This is a short informational video for the Monarch BPU by Butterfly Labs. Straight out of the box we have a BPU connected to the sled frame which integrates a mounting bracket for the radiator cooling system. Also in the box we have a standard USB A to B cable along with a fan adapter cable. The fan adapter cable simply connects to the radiator fan like so and the other end of the cable offers a pass-through connector for connecting to standard hard drive power cables. The B plug of the USB cable attaches to this end of the card. However, some early models of the Monarch BPU had a mini B socket which has now been deactivated. The power supply specification for a 700 GHz BPU is around 650 watts, which from a 12 volt rail should draw approximately 46 amps. It's very important that you look at the rating label on your power supply to ensure it meets this minimum spec. It's also worth noting that the wires from the power supply should be at least 16 AWG as well. It's absolutely essential that you do not power the BPU through one of these power supply splitter cables that you may have left over from a graphics card installation. The BPU itself needs two direct connections from the card back to the power supply to handle the high power. The use of splitter cables could overheat and potentially catch fire. So, once the USB and the power connections are made, turn on the power supply and ensure that both the radiator fan and the rear heating fan are both rotating. It's essential that both of these fans are operational prior to hashing. Drivers for the BPU USB interface are supplied for Windows 7 and above. Alternatively, you can find drivers for Linux on the links listed below. It's worth noting again, however, the use of underrated power supplies or cable splitters could result in failure which is not covered by the Butterfly Labs warranty. If you would like to mount the BPU card into a PCI Express slotted for computer, simply remove the four fixed screws from the radiator and then remove the four nuts from the rear of the card. This will allow you then to install the card into your computer motherboard, ensuring you locate and fix the radiator on either the front or rear face of the case, with the fan blowing the hotter outwards. You will need drivers for the PCI Express interface, which can be found on our website, butterflylabs.com drivers. The sled system is very handy if you want to run the BPU externally. However, it's worth noting here that the Butterfly Labs have specified data center grade hoses for the cooling system to ensure a leak-free environment. In the likely event that your system develops a leak, raise an RMA request from your account dashboard and we'll have the car swapped out under warranty. This concludes the hardware. For the software, part two of this guide will describe setting up a Bitcoin wallet, configuring a mining client and configuring a mining pool account, which can be found on the links below.